I'll do my best. Yeah, This is the largest chunk of the review cards. When all are filled, all of today's review cards are complete. A small chunk for each card. This number of chunks is the number of chunks in the top progress bar. The number of small chunks can be changed in settings cards dash target card values. Current setting is 10, so reviewing 10 cards will fill the second progress bar. For example, if the number of cards due today is 80, and the small chunk is 10, the large chunk is 8. Small chunk can be set to a maximum of 100. If the cards due today are 1300, and the small chunk is 100, the large chunk is 13. 3rd progress bar counts 10 seconds per review. This 3rd progress bar is compatible with Atten Speed Focus Mode, which answers automatically. If you turn it on in the settings, the number of seconds in the progress bar will be the same as the number set in the speed focus. The progress bar at the bottom is the Pomodoro timer. Click on a character to count 25 minutes. While the Pomodoro timer is counting, the remaining time is displayed in the menu bar. Also, the character glows green while the Pomodoro timer is active. The material on the right side glows according to card status. New card, bright blue new card in learning, blue review card, green relearning, red relearning plus leech, purple. Line thickness can be adjusted in the settings, 0 10, if you set it to 0, it can be hidden. The Pomodoro timer time can be changed in the settings. Minimum 1 minute, maximum 1 hour. By default, the progress bar advances only with review cards. New or relearning cards will not advance even if you answer them correctly. Then, when all of today's review cards are done, start counting all new cards and relearning cards.
This function can be disabled by unchanged decking count only review cards at first. Break timer can be activated from the menu bar. The default setting is 5 minutes. This break timer can be interrupted by right clicking. This break timer can be started in three different ways. Start from the menu bar. When the Pomodoro timer is done. When the target number of cards has been completed. The setting to start the break timer when the Pomodoro timer is done is located under the time set for the Pomodoro timer. The default setting is off. The setting to auto start the break timer when the target card count is done can be found in the advanced settings on the card tab. Enable advanced and then enable start break timer after target cards count is done. The default setting is off. When the break timer is started, there is a function to auto hide Anki by put it into the taskbar. The default setting is off. When the break there is a fade and fade out function when you hide Anki. But this function may not work outside of Windows. I have tested it on Mac and Linux and it causes flickering. There is a fade and if you use speed focus mode, there is a problem with the card auto advancing when you hide Anki. In this case, activate the setting to auto stop speed focus. This setting can be found in the other tab, under advanced. The volume of background music and action effects can be adjusted in the sound tab. If it is distracting, try setting it to zero. You can change the character from the theme tab. Currently there are three types of characters. Themes can also be changed by right-clicking on the character or material during review. I'll do my best. Change the size setting on the theme tab to scale the character and progress bar. To activate the setting, you will need to restart Anki.
change.